Hi, I'm Valder Beebe, and I host the Valder Beebe Show on FM radio and online television. I am famously known for That Celebrity Interview, where I conduct interviews all over the globe by cell phone, in studio, or satellite media tours. Go to ValderBeebeShow.com, YouTube.com slash ValderBeebeShow, or our partnership network with Business in the Black, BlackSuccessAcademy.com, and click on the Valder BB Show channel. I'll see you there. Good day, Alexis Davalos <laughs> and Lou Kleintank. How are you guys? Pretty good. Doing good yeah. yeah. I am so well. I'm so excited that you guys joined us. We've been talking about you guys on Facebook yesterday and today. And if we could start with Alexa, women are always <laughs> first in my world. I'm sorry about that, Lou. Hey, look, you're always first in my world, too. That's All right, right then. <laughs> Tell me about the man in High Castle <laughs> and your role. Oh, the man on the high castle. Uh, it's a, it's an extraordinary world. It's a very, very wild what if scenario. Um, we're living in an alternate, alternate history, um, which has been magical. Uh, Juliana Crane is, is, uh, very close to my heart. She's, um, she's a tenacious young woman who's, who's just been thrown into really extraordinary circumstances and, um, is forced to be a chameleon to survive. Um, She's been just unbelievably good fun to play. I know it's set in, in, in the past, but mm -hmm. what same similarities did you find to today's women? Oh, man, you know, I think, I think she's, she's, in every, she's sort of every woman. You know, when we started the, the show, she was, you know, living her life and doing her best and, 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 you know, maintaining sort of a semblance of simplicity in her world and... Um, you know, and then and then this wild thing happens to her. I think I think she's, you know, there's no difference really. Women then, women now. There's a difference in terms of what our what our world is as far as you know social media and 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 political aspects and all of that. But I think, um, as a woman, she's, you know, yeah, not not too different today. Not too think. different. Well, I, I thought we were so. going to leave some of those problems behind. No. <laughs> <laughs> Look, you play the character Joe Blake, if I'm correct, a suspect. Good. Tell yes. me about that. Tell you about Joe in season two? Yes. Yeah, um, Yeah. no, Joe Joe is just uh, really on a, uh, an emotional journey in season two. He's kind of discovering um, himself, his past, uh, the relationship with his father that he never knew, um, and dealing with all the things that he had to, he had to accomplish and, um, and the terrible things that he had to do in, in accomplishing the things in season one so he's 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 really just on a psychological journey um in his mind and uh and uh yeah he's 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 he's, he's dealing with a lot in season two since this is based on the award-winning 1962 well based on the award-winning novel and this alternate history does this make you think different luke in your real life yeah i mean because it's uh you're looking at something different. It's it's some, sometimes it's really hard to kind of separate yourself from your own reality, but this this allows you to see something different. So it makes you question a lot. Does it make you different? I don't know if it makes me different. I think it just it, it opens my eyes to um, something that could be, and it, and it and it makes me have an internal discussion in my own mind. That's good, yeah. because I think conversations today are very shallow and very superficial, so that sounds like a great thing. Let me ask you, Alexa, you know, I was looking at uh, kind of your resume of the, the leading people you have been with, and I always like to ask this question, mm -hmm. how'd you do that with, uh, you know, Dermot McRoney and Hayden Church? Those are pretty, pretty good actors to oh, be in the same sentence with. That's this guy. You're I think you're talking about me because I. I'm sorry. With, I, 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 yes, I'm sorry. <laughs> I meant to say Luke. I'm sorry. Uh, both of those actors are fantastic. Um, 
Well, I mean, Alexa's worked with some amazing actors it is. as well. <laughs> uh, no, I think it's great because we're all like-minded people, you know? We, we do this for the same reason, I feel. Mm. Um, we're, 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 we're artists at heart and we, we love storytelling. And uh, we love creating something. And we love to think and, and have that kind of um, internal dialogue in our own minds. I think, we're a lot of, I think a lot of us are somewhat introverts in a way. Mm -hmm. uh, there are a lot of extroverts too, but I think internally we, we, uh, we're, constantly, we're constantly talking to ourselves. Alexa, what are we going to get out of The Man in High Castle in season two? Oh, man. Uh, it'll be, I think, it, that, at the end of that last episode, it, it'll be, uh, I think you'll feel sort of depleted and exhausted, but in a really, really good way. It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a crazy season, this one. Um, we really go into, into places one would never have thought, and I think um, it's full of surprises. Um, and we and we really get to get to sort of see deeper into these characters and understand more and more of who they are. And I think that's that's the whole purpose of these things. You know, you follow these characters for multiple seasons. You want to feel like you know them better, and I think you do. I read a little quote for, about you, Alexa, where uh, one of the uh, reviewers say, uh, "You're eye candy, and they can't get enough of you on the screen." <laughs> How do you feel about? Uh, I'm. <laughs> uh. That, yeah, I, well, that's uh, subjective. Um, uh, <laughs> I know. <laughs> Come on. Um, uh, well, thank you. I don't know. I, I, I um, yeah. What do you say? <laughs> what do you say? <laughs> what do you say? You say thank you very much. And thank you I very suppose. much. Well, yeah. I agree with them. So uh, well, you know. So maybe you. that is subjective. Well, but I'll, th I do. I'll thank you then. Thank you. <laughs> thank you, Helga. I'll wrap up with you, Luke. You yeah. know, The Man in High Castle, it is an, an Emmy Award-winning Amazon Prime. That's no little feat. How do, you, how do you top that? Where do you take that as an actor? Um, I think we just continue on, you know? I mean, you know, award aside, I think it's a great honor to, to be recognized, but I think we just continue on and keep telling the story that we're telling. Mm -hmm. And uh, I, I hope that we can do it for many years to come. Okay. Can we binge on season one? You can binge season one, yeah. yeah. Uh, and you, you, you can binge season two tomorrow, too. You can binge season two <laughs> tomorrow. <laughs> all right, and it's all, tell me where it is. It's all on Amazon Prime, right? Amazon, it's all on Prime. Amazon Prime. Thank you, guys, and Thank you. happy Thank holidays, you. and happy good holidays. luck with the man in High Castle. It's a great, it's a great show. Thank, Thank you, you very much. much.